Hello, fellow beings of light. I am Julie Joy of the Young Light Workers Channel with another message for you today from Anne and the Angels for October 12th, 2024. And the title of this message is In the Calm and the Storm, I Am With You. And they begin, My dear friends, we love you so very much. In the peace and in the storms, we are there with you. In the calm and in chaos, the divine is within, waiting for you to breathe and allow its magnificent love to bubble up from within, guide and comfort you. Never are you without direction. Never are you without help. Never are you without love. Even when you don't have cell service, you have soul service. When you don't have electricity, you still have inner power. When you feel disconnected, sit for a minute and breathe into the inner world in which you are connected with all things, all beings, and all that you require. The dear creatures on your planet do not have devices, electricity, or even written words, and yet they live in complete harmony with nature and one another. They surrender to life as life presents itself and receive guidance at all times to help them satisfy their own intentions of being comfortable, sustained, and loved. You can live in this harmony and connection as well. When it looks like your world is in chaos, the inner world is always a temple of refuge and a place of peace. Beneath the choppy waves on the surface of the sea, there exists a calm ocean. Beneath the choppy and turbulent situations on your earth, there exists a calm presence. Whether you are dealing with storms, grief, life's challenges, politics you don't enjoy, or a variety of other things you find challenging, remember this, dear ones, God is with you. The presence of love that lives within never leaves you. The help you require is there for you. If you can truly believe, you will receive. From the divine, there is a constant outflow of love, guidance, support, and well-being. You can tap in at any time. We know that life can be a struggle, but if you can stop struggling with life and accept it as it comes while simultaneously reaching for more, then your challenges become simply adventures that give way to kinder adventures. Your problems become launching pads for solutions. Your concerns become the fertilizer for your desires. You say this often, life happens. How you respond to the external is an inside job. Try to respond with this mindset. I am having an adventure. If I like it, I'd like more, please. If I don't, then I'd like a kinder adventure. I know that my desire in this moment for better is strong. I know I have already set the universal wheels in motion. Dear ones, we love you. We are with you in calm and in storm, sickness and health, good times and bad. We never leave you. The presence and power within is always there. Sit with us. Breathe. Receive our love. We want to help your lives become greater adventures in love, serenity, joy, and all that you wish. God bless you. We love you so very much. And this is, of course, a message from the angels. It's channeled by my dear friend, Ann Albers. And this message came in very shortly after the two tremendous hurricanes that struck the East Coast recently. Ann Albers' own website is visionsofheaven.com. Please stop by there and see everything that she has to offer. Also, I believe I will be able to place the words to this message below in the show more section. I am Julie Joy, your servant of the light, and it's always my honor and pleasure to bring these remarkable messages directly to you, my loyal viewers and listeners from the angels. And please don't forget to create a great day.